Oh, we get to cut the dark right up. That, that felt really quick. Because epic shit has occurred. I'm guessing it's switching the dark. That felt short. No epic boss fight in the end. Cog's story end. Realization. What's it called? What's it called? Reunion. Whoa. Oh, they're gonna meet each other already? Jeez. Oh, well, they ain't Drake in. Is that a chest over there? It almost looks like a chest on the top of a mountain there. Probably just a building. <laughs> that dark. Where the hell did he disappear to? Maybe he got maybe he got snatched up by the Diswald. No way, Dark never get himself caught by any humans. Yeah, but don't forget that human ship we saw fly over a while while we were fighting. Those nasty humans might be doing some experiments on him right now. Oh, just like they did on me. Would you shut up? Then why doesn't he come back? How the hell should I know? Maybe he's tired of your mouth, Delma, dear. <laughs> he's tired of your mouth, Delma, dear. And that's why he doesn't come back. Ho 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 ho. What? Just try saying that again, you old bitty. Itty bitty. Ah, uh, the color of Delma's anger. A light blossom pink. Her feelings shift from pale rose to bright golden yellow. Yes, she misses him. Anxiety. She, she's worried about Dark. Worried? Me? You don't go with your... You don't know what you're talking about. Uh, uh, you don't know anything. <laughs> she shuffles her feet. That's why I'm worried about Dark. Why? What? Wait. Sorry, I, I'm not reading right. <laughs> Dumbo, what the fuck did you just say? You're not much of a liar. This girl isn't hard to read. We can tell what she's thinking in that rough little head of hers. Would you all just shut up about me already? We've all got to figure out how we're going to find Dark. But you know, we've just gone about everywhere we can think of already. Yeah, but... Wait a minute. Haven't you noticed how Dark's been tormented by something ever since he, we came to Ragnoth? Maybe whatever we, he went off and something, <clears throat> wherever he went off to, has something to do with it. Dark's been tormented. Yeah, well, come to think of it, he didn't <clears throat> he didn't want to go see Willowill by himself by himself at that time. In that case, maybe we should go see Willowo and see what we can find out. Miles ahead of you, old hag. Yep, it's time to go see Willowo. I get to run around as Delma. I'm surprised I don't get to choose who's the main combatant. Oh, what the fuck? Choco's with me? Who the hell's that? She wasn't in the cutscene. Aww. And she never will be now. Ugh. <coughs> At least I think. Something happens in the end. Probably not. <laughs> okay, Willy Woe. Holy shit, you bunch of colorful guys, aren't you? Hey, you, Willow Woe. What the hell did you say to Dark to make him take off like that? <coughs> Who are you? What business do you have here? While we were fighting the humans, Dark disappeared. <clears throat> I need to clear my throat. What? Dark is missing? Don't worry, Dark would never let himself get done in by any of mere any mere humans. You can count on that. But ever since Dark came here, something's been bothering him. And you came to ask if I knew what it was, right? That's right. Figured you might know something about it. First, let me ask you something. Sagan told me from the Orkhan, Lupine, and Pianta tribes. Not one of you are the same uh, from the same tribe. And so Dark certainly isn't your tribe leader. Why then do you bother with him? What is Dark to you exactly? And why do you follow him? Because he's our friend. Because he's our friend. Friend? You talk like humans. I suppose Dark's father Windolf would have understood how you feel, but to tell you the truth, 
I don't understand that <clears throat> that way of thinking at all. But maybe friends are that dark <clears throat> dark needs right now. True friends might be just the thing the boy needs. He who is destined for solitude. Now, before I tell you what dark tr <laughs> what troubles dark, I have to tell you more about Dark's mother and father. Fade out. Fade in. Holy shit! Hmm. What's the matter? Oh, you had lost for words? Now the music changed. I feel a little surprised that it would do that. Well, I don't suppose I can blame you. Ark is not a Deimos. And yet, he's not a human either. And he and had... <clears throat> He had a twin brother once, but now that twin is dead. No matter of where he goes in his world, in this world, he'll never find another like him. No one feels no one can feel the pain he feels. No one can understand his worries. He's all alone in the world. That is what is tormenting him. G dark. <laughs> Would you find? Would you do? Would you do find what? What when? Oh, sorry. Ugh, I can't read words properly. When you do find Dark, I have something I want you to give him. It's the Dragon, the Dragonian ri Dragonia ring. Okay. His father used to used to wear. Oh, Dragonia ring. Okay. Holy crap! Do you see that? That chandelier is shifting back and forth. Why is that happening? Fuck it. Well, gee. It's not like I should be surprised that he's half Deimos. Oh, what is that? Ex what is that? Exaviated sigh? I guess... I can't believe this. I guess. <laughs> Dark, never no, Dark never told any of, any of this. What's any of this? Well, I knew his father was dead. But I never heard anything about his mo mother or twin brother about him being dead, about them being dead. So, Doc had a twin, a brother, in the same situation he was in. If only that twin had lived. I bet Doc's burden would have been easier to bear. Poor Doc. No. No? What does that mean? What? What do you mean, no, Babadora? Dark's thoughts, they still remain in this place. Dark doesn't believe he's all alone in the world. He's thinking of his brother. He believes he's still alive. And he's thinking he wants to find him. Okay. No way. Are you trying to tell us Dark went looking for his brother? It could be true. Well, if he is, where in the world should we start looking for him? Hey, didn't Willow say something about Dark's mother? He said, he said she was from a human world, called, a human town called Ubel. That's right here in Ragnarok. Ubel, huh? I guess we have no other choice. Let's go. They're gonna go into Ubel. Dark's one thing, but a freaking herd of Deimos come running in there. In their situation, everyone all desperate and crazy, and probably ready to slice up any Deimos that come running along. Eh, of course they don't have no idea to know that, but shit, things aren't gonna go well. Okay. Let's go on to you, Bell. Surely fight some Sasuke Squirrel. What the? The world music's different. I guess we started the castle ruins. It's Delma's overworld music. Enjoy the new overture for now.